Thousands of Kentucky children need a loving home. WDRB's Molly Jett explains why foster care parents are needed more than ever. St. Joseph Children's Home has provided a safe and loving home for more than 75,000 boys and girls. And for one Kentucky family, that journey started about a decade ago. We, at the time, were struggling with the, the idea that, you know, we may not have kids of our own. In 2013, Greg and Valerie Bucola found themselves at the annual St. Joe's picnic. About a year later, they became foster care parents and then parents. Brother and a sister and adopted them and then 11 months later took in another brother and sister and adopted them as well. So we went from zero to four in less than a year. Right now, more than 8,600 Kentucky children need that same support, a home, and the need is growing. People perceive that foster care is a, uh, a temporary, scary, uh, traumatic thing for their, to, that disrupts their family life. And the reality is there's a lot of different ways you can help. Last week, Governor Andy Bashir announced his administration is providing $41.5 million to support the state's foster care children and those who care for them. I know for a fact there are a lot of people watching this right now who have thought about it. You have to think about what those kids are going through and you have to show up for your community. Last year, St. Joseph Children's Home placed 57 children. That's down from 73 in 2019. Oftentimes, most parents prefer young children or babies over teenagers. Fostering teenagers requires giving them a lot of grace. For the Bucola family, unconditional love. And having patience. From one couple to four children. The reward you will get and having a family you never imagined will be ama amazing. Formed a family forever. In Louisville, with photojournalist Jonathan McEmber, I'm Molly Jett, WDRB News.